Hi everyone, here we've got LG G8X Thank You, and let me show you how to enable power saving mode on this device. So first of all, let's get into the settings. Here let's find battery, let's scroll down a little and as you can see here we've got the battery saver, so let's tap on it. As you can see now the battery saver is off, so it is in a normal mode, but we can choose uh, either extended mode or maximum mode. So let me pick for example extended and now your device is telling you what will be less restricted. Uh, it will restrict vibration, background activity, always on display if you have one and maximum brightness. Let's click on turn on. And as you can see by this icon, the battery saver has been activated. Let me get back. And as you can see here, we've got power saving exclusions. So let's tap on it. And here you will be able to choose apps, which will be um, announced even with power saving mode uh, turned on. So to, so to select the one you want to still uh, receive any notifications, simply tap on the switcher right next to it. Let me get back, let's go to the battery saver and now let's choose the maximum mode. So let's tap on it. Uh, of course your device now is telling you uh, what will be restricted, so the vibration and Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and location, night mode, background activity always on display, brief notifications, maximum brightness will be lower and frame rate will be reduced. So let's click on switch mode, let's wait a second. And as you can see, every, everything actually turns black and um, all the activities have been limited. It is in order, of course, to save the battery. If you want to uh, get back to, the, to its normal mode, then simply go to the settings. Let's find the battery again and let's click on battery saver. Now let's click on off. Wait a second. And as you can see, your device just turned back to its normal state. So that's all. This is how to enable battery saver in your LG G8X. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. If you find that this video was helpful, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.